All right, so we are seeing a lot of trailers these days of movies. I'm talking about Indian movies where men are uh, shown to lose hair and they're also losing sleep. Um, I'd say the problem is real, not just with men, but also with women. And I have had a lot of uh, problem of, uh, of the same sort. So, you know, what I came up with after you have no idea how many things I tried. I came up with a few tips that I must share with you. I uh, I was uh, reading about the structure of cell and I found that um, the plasma membrane is made up of proteins and lipids and that gave me an idea. Okay, so it is the protein which gives anything in this world the three dimension every it brings two dimensional things into uh, the three dimensional state and that's why if you notice people who uh, have a lot of protein and they're gymming protein powder they buff up we put eggs um, into cake to to allow it to uh, get fluffy <laughs> uh, so protein is by far there is no doubt. Protein is by far the nutrient, the best nutrient that can give your hair volume. But you can't be just applying it on the surface of hair because if you put <laughs> all kinds of uh, eggs and meat and all, and of course lentils on your skin, that's not going to. Uh, increase the volume of your hair you have to consume it me being a vegetarian i don't have much option um, I, i'm left with nuts and lentils and such things and milk to consume and then that i do you won't be consuming it a lot though and just like calcium you just can't be having milk all the time and feel that okay your your bones will get stronger until unless you increase the absorption of it so the proteins absorption increases if you have a lot of citrus fruits so that's there otherwise you might be thinking you're having a lot of pulses and uh, lentils and milk in your diet and still nothing is happening and if the second part as i said was lipid lipid means a bit of fats fats you fats bring a boundary they build a boundary so that your hair are not damaged it it uh, gives a coating right so you could you could consume good fats fats won't make you fat if you consume good good fats like butter ghee and you could also apply it in your hair but then there is one thing that I must bring to your notice and that is that it's just if you're a vegetarian just to, just don't restrict yourself to having vegetarian food also apply organic stuff you can't be applying all kind of chemicals on yourself and think that okay vegetarian diet would give you what you want in your life so uh, so try and stick to applying um, fuller earth in your hair onion paste but when you see that your hair have gone dead, it's very difficult to see any difference in it. So I felt a difference when I revived it by giving it some kind of an intoxication to bring it back to life. And that intoxication was tea leaves. So when you apply uh, some kind of a mask, at least for a week or two, when you feel that you know just like emergency uh, steps are needed and you've lost a lot of your hair so in your mask along with uh, onion paste please put some tea leaves black tea green tea whatever and uh, continue doing it for a week's time I have felt a difference you'll see it too I'm so sure of it you have to religiously follow a certain regime to see some uh, solid difference into things continuous effort is required so that's that from my side all the best uh, if I see some other if I feel there is something other that I bring to you that I should share with you should I bring to your notice and that can really help things 
uh, for the positive. I'll do that. As for now, bye-bye.